Man. I can't believe we are back in this prison cell again after what we did a few days ago, but this time, we are sentenced to life imprisonment and these cells are immune to beyond logic, so we can't escape. I know right Tayshawn, we shouldn't have broken to Ruth and Mark's house, attacked them until blood came out, kidnapped Lamar, team up with the Alanosiums, abused Lamar yet again along with two other minors. And I say two minors since our son is now a legal adult. I know right Keisha, I shouldn't have gave Lamar, Chloe and Athen third degree burns and, and attempted to kill our only son along with those two teen girls to get our revenge. I wish I can go back in time and stop all of that from happening. Tayshawn and Keisha gravely, you have two visitors and they are not too happy with you. Mom and Dad, why are you guys here? Don't play your innocent bullshit with me, you know damn well why we are here. Is it because of what we did to Lamar on his 18th birthday and what we did a few days ago? Yes the fuck it is, you fucking child abusers. But dad, our son deserved those punishments after all the crap he has done since 2021 with his flying eagle friends, so we did the right thing disciplining him. Yeah. What my wife said, Lamar is just a pain in the ass who should have been disowned years ago, and he also should have been aborted since we never loved him because of his shitty ass behavior. Shut your pie holes up. Yes, Lamar is a troublemaker and is part of the flying eagles, but that still does not give you the go-ahead to abuse him for literally no reason in his 18th birthday, and the fact that you escaped prison, teamed up with those nasty criminals called the Alanistims, broke into Ruth's and Mark's house, assaulted your own siblings brutally, kidnapped Lamar along with two other teenage girls for your own freaking enjoyment. Never. I would love to see my daughter do something as sick as this. And as for you Tayshawn, my sorry excuse of a son-in-law, we heard about what you did. You pushed Lamar and those teenagers into a pool of boiling hot water which gave them third degree burns. And the worst thing about it is that you attempted to kill our grandson and those two minors for your own entertainment. What the fuck is wrong with you? I can't believe I allowed my daughter to marry a psychopath like you. You better be lucky that Lamar is still alive. Otherwise we would have beat the shit out of you. You're 41 years old and should know better than than this, not a four-year-old toddler. And the guys that brainless or something, doing all of that can get you arrested for child abuse, assault, abduction and attempted murder, and look what has happened to you guys. I can't believe I gave birth to a psychopath, we're filing a restraining order for you guys to stay away from our grandson and the rest of our family. You guys disgust me, that's it Keisha, you are grounded for the rest of your life. But mom, I am way too old for that, I am 38 years old. A grown woman, I am not a minor anymore. I don't give a shit! You are still grounded for the rest of your pathetic life. The same applies to you, Tayshawn. We don't want to see your faces or have anything to do with you guys forever. We are cutting ties with you. We are leaving now and we hope you guys enjoy the rest of your life behind bars, you horrible child. Abusing pieces of shits. No guys, please don't do this to us, we are so sorry for abusing Lamar, can you guys just get us out of this hellhole? It's too late for that. You should have thought twice before abusing our grandson and kidnapping those two girls and attempting to kill them. Goodbye forever, you bitches. Well that's just great, we got grounded and our family don't want anything to do with us. This is the worst day ever.